What is up everybody and welcome back to Minecraft Divinity with Mods. So last episode we were searching for five diamonds when it actually should have been six diamonds. Uh, so we can go back home, so we can make a pickaxe, so we can uh, <clears throat> we can get the um, enchantment table and finally, you know, just get everything we need to try to advance along um, in the game. So I'm here in the Twilight Forest still and I was walking a little bit and I found another maze which hopefully will have some diamonds in it um, and also a wild boar. So yeah, I thought I you know might as well start it at the maze. We're kind of in this weird, weird swampy biome and I see there's a wolf. Now I have 18 bones so this wolf will probably help me with the maze, if I can get him. Wow, that was quick, okay. If I can get these guys to be on my side, I'm sure this maze will be no problem. Really? One bone? <laughs> these guys are easy. Easy wolf picking. So, there we go. Um, yeah, let's just get all of them, because, you know, you can never be too safe. There we go. Okay, so, all of you guys come with me. I'm going in with a wolf army to go... And attack the maze. Now, I set up a little camp right here. I'm not even sure if that bed will work, seeing as how it's always nighttime. But, um, hopefully. And, uh, yeah, let's see. Because we found one diamond in the past maze. Is he going to come with me? I hope so. I found one diamond in the past maze, so maybe I can find... Oh, they're already getting hurt. Why? I don't know, but one's already almost dead. Great. Oh, they're phasing through the walls. Well, this is... This hasn't been helpful at all. Thank you, wolves, even though there's no mobs. Come on, normal. Where's all the mobs, huh? Are they all afraid? This one's a weird... This one has, like, moss. Or not moss, like, vines. Yeah, these guys are just... These guys are just literally phasing through the walls and killing themselves. Great! Aha! My first one! I forgot there's hostile wolves. I thought that was actually one of my own. Uh... Let's break it, break it, break it. Oh, break it and shake it. Die. Wolf. Okay. What we got in here? Nothing. Melon seeds. Someone yelled at me for not taking those last time, so I'll take them this time. Uh, we still have Larry with us, the cicada, who's keeping us company, I guess, and being annoying. Uh, these are just fireflies. What about here? No, come on, give me a diamond. Uh -oh, uh -oh, uh oh, I hear him. I hear him. I hear him. Where are they? Ooh, I hate the sound. They're all creepy crawly. Swarm spiders. Jeez. That means that, oh, yep, spawner's close, which usually is also a chest. Which has not diamonds. Come on. Notch. Even though this isn't even close to being notches. Ooh, two chests. Yes! Alright, that's another one. So, yeah, we need six. Did I mention that? We need six, not five. I miscounted. Um, that's why I... Oop, I changed the title of the last episode. Oh my god! Uh... Yeah, we need, we actually need six diamonds because the enchant uh, enchanting table takes a little bit more um, diamonds than I had calculated. So if we want everything, we need six. So now I have three, which means we need three more. Um, so yeah, that's <laughs> that's about it. We need three more diamonds. <sighs> God, I mean, hopefully we can find some. I'm thinking we just walk around a little more after I finish off this. This, um, you know, maze. Let's go on top. Let's cheat. This is this is me cheating. Oh, my God. Why am I getting hit? Is that a thing? Do you get hurt? <laughs> do you get hurt if you go up on top of the maze? Oh, my God. You do. Wow. He actually makes it so you can't cheat? What? Oh, well, I found it. <laughs> that's so... That's, that's actually pretty, in, like, good <laughs> that he did that to stop people like me from just cheating throughout the entire maze. Come on, diamond, baby. Diamond. Ah, Really could use some diamonds. Like, really badly. I just want to get out of this place. Just want to go home. Please. So, okay, we can't step on top of the maze. That I did not know. Now I do. Also, I may as well just collect some of these fireflies and just use them as torches. Because they're a little easier to get than torches. Uh, is that a chest? I've, I think I've already gone to this. these. Yeah. Okay. Are we done here? All of my... Oh. Is that... No, it's just a boar. Oh, I see. So the wolves were standing on top of these blocks, which just kill you. That's why they were dying. I was wondering. I was like, they didn't look like they were phasing through the blocks that badly. But it's just because if you go on top of the blocks, you die, and all the wolves are just doing that exact thing. Okay. That makes much more sense. Oh, well. Wolf army did not help. Um, I think this one may be dry. 
a vault chest. Let's just get out of here. I mean, we could just take shears to this place and just go mad, right? Oh, no. Oh, my God. That hurts you, too? Hitting the blocks hurts you. And I'm back. God, this guy thought of everything. Uh, now, there were these strange ruins over here, which I was kind of intrigued by. Maybe if we could, like, dig up something. You guys are telling me that there actually is stuff beneath the ruins that I was checking out before that I just, you know, was being dumb and wasn't really looking hard enough. And, oops, I guess. Uh, let's take the bed with us. Mm, I'm, I'm debating whether or not... We do need some more food. Should we set up camp? It's only three raw, raw pork chops. not really worth, you know, setting up a whole camp for. Uh, I don't know. Let's drop the leather. Well, then again, you know what? We have a lot of iron, too. You know what? I'll go, I'll go scout out the area, and we'll come back here. So, yeah, that. Uh, let's make... Oh, let's throw Larry on the ground. <laughs> Put some furnaces down. Um, we'll make two furnaces. And go and scout out the area. Now I have a bed, so I don't need these this wool anymore. And throw that into the lake. There we go. Um, grab this up. Yeah. So I need because I need some more iron armor. My my armor is not faring too well. Uh, five, 40, 48, 56. There we go. And then what else was I gonna cook? Oh yeah, the pork chops. All right. Good. So let's go and look around a little bit more. Oh wait, forgot one thing. Don't want to die without a spawn place. As we learned last time. And hopefully we're safe now. Okay. Uh, there's this, yeah, this weird kind of ravine looking thing. It's like a really shallow ravine. It's, a, it's strange because, yeah, I'm like in this swamp place. Everything's a little just a little weird. A little off here. It's a very, very shallow ravine, actually. Look at this. It's kind of cool. Um, it looks like there's not much like in it, though. Which kind of stinks. Uh, our camp is that way. So if we follow the ravine, we can get back to camp. Which is nice. Which means we can just kind of travel along it until it ends. Um, which is about right now. Okay, so there's nothing over there. Oh, there's another one right here. Okay, yeah, this one's a little bit deeper. And it goes into nothing or a cave? I can't tell from up here. Dang it. Alright, whatever. So that's kind of nothing over there. Um, oh yeah, there was this, uh, this like, massive bundle of trees. This, alright. Oh my god! Do you guys see that? That's so diamond on the wall. There was a massive bundle of trees over there, which is, like, a really dark, kind of scary forest. Which I didn't really want to go into. Look at that. It looks so, like, ominous. Um, let me dig up here. And then, uh, I don't know. I'm gonna def I'm gonna go down there. I have to get those diamonds. This may be our ticket home. May just be our ticket home. Finally get out of this place and have everything we came for. Oh, there's nothing beneath this. Why? What? There's nothing beneath that. Or at least nothing in the... Is that bedrock? Okay, this is strange. I hear, like, a bee. Is that a bee? Nope, that's a bird. Why do I hear a bee? Oh my god, because there's mosquitoes! Get... That is a really cool entity. Look at that. That's so cool. It's actually stuck on the vines. Get wrecked, mosquitoes. Oh, I thought that was a bee. Okay, so we are going to get those diamonds. That looks like there was two. <laughs> I swear if there's only two, I'm going to I'm gonna scream to the heavens. Because <sighs> we need three. <laughs> and there's only, it looks like there's only two down there. All right, let's take our pork. Take our iron. Let's make some gear. Uh, so what needs it the most? Shoes and the hat. Let's make shoes and hat, and then we'll leave of the rest. Shoes. Can we do that? Yep. Hat. Uh, shoes. Or hat. Shoes. There we go. Alright. Take the rest of the iron with us. And the coal. Alright. So, if there's three down there... Let's leave that there. If there's three diamonds down there, we are finally done. We are just finally done with this place. We can get out. Oh, there's more mosquitoes. If there's only two... We are absolutely screwed, and we're going to need to find some more diamonds elsewhere. I hear s more mosquitoes. I hate mosquitoes. <laughs> I think we're like, I think humans like programmed to just hate mosquitoes. Oh my god. <sighs> okay. What's with the what's with the bedrock and the stupid kobolds? Actually, you know what was funny? I was playing a 
Kingdom, Kingdom of Alamore or whatever, Reckoning, and there was actually kobolds. And I'm like, what? They're like kind of a real monster. Is there really only two? No, don't. Oh my god, there's only two. Ah! Ah. I thought we only needed one diamond to make an enchanting table. I'm going to look it up right now. But I guess we need two. Enchantment table, yeah, you need two diamonds. So that means we need three diamonds for a pick uh, to get the obsidian to make the enchantment table, which would cost two more diamonds. So that's five. And then we need one diamond to just get back home. So that's six. So we are officially missing one diamond. And what is with the bedrock? <laughs> this is a little strange. But I'm glad I scouted the area because at least we now we only need one diamond and not three. Is there any more? Like, I can't believe there's just a there's just diamonds lining the walls. That's oh my god, there's more. Oh, two more diamonds. I hope that's three. Cause if it's three, we can make a sword. Please be three. Damn. Ah. Oh. Oh my god, like, I'm just so relieved, though. Larry, we're going home! You can go and you can meet Sir Francis and Wilson and everybody and, I don't know, Darkwing the Third if that ever happens. Oh, god, you're gonna love them. You can just sit... Oh, get the hell away. You can just sit on the wall all day, Larry. And there's just a million of these guys. They, like, multiply in the water or something? Oh my god, there's a million! Did it really do? It looks like they're multiplying in the water. Die. Okay. I'm trying to fight this current. And get... Oh, crap. Oh, God. Okay, this isn't good. They've, they've, they've heard that I'm trying to leave. And they don't want me to go. Guys, I'm sorry, but it's time. It's time. Ah. Ah. Oh, come on. Oh, not you, creep. Not you too, creeper. You too, buddy. Okay. <laughs> There, it looks like I see grass. This is gonna lead me out. I hope so. Oh God. Uh, get me out of this place. This is the shallow. Yeah, this is the shallow place we saw. Do I have any blocks? Ooh, that that kind of is not good. That I don't really have many. Um, I'm trying to find a way we can just go up. I don't wanna. I don't wanna be digging and digging and digging. I can't believe there were just four diamonds just lining the walls. That is so awesome. Okay. That was a waste of blocks. Oh, uh, come on. Get up there. Get up there. Alright, good. Uh, <laughs> I'm still I'm still not up. Oops. Here, ready for this pro... Whoa, lag? Give me a break. Why well, can't... Oh, I can't run because of my food. Let's take some iron for the trip. There we go. I mean, we're not home yet. We still need to make the portal back. All right, here we go. Nice. Yes! <sighs> okay, so, now, um, we need a crafting bench. We need a crafting bench. Where is, this is the ravine. Is my, I don't remember which way my, it's this way. Let's go back to that camp I made. Um, and we can use the crafting bench to make some buckets so we can make a portal <laughs> back home. Get out of this twisted place. I mean, like, so the Twilight Forest God, has, has so many minerals, but it's just, it's just so dangerous that, like, I don't really know what I would do. Um, exactly, if that makes sense. Like, I don't know. I, I mean, I, I, could come, I could come back here maybe if I needed more minerals, but I'd, I'd like, feel so so afraid. Maybe when I have like, you know, full diamond gear and I'm amazing, I'll come back here to try to get some of the epic loot that I guess I didn't even touch upon. You know, the stuff we found in the maze like that one charm. I hear mosquitoes. That one charm. Maybe try to get some of that. Um, and yeah, just, I don't know, more stuff. So we need vegetation. We already have one flower, which is good. We need more vegetation, like I said in the beginning, before the, the you know, destruction of universes that led us to being trapped here. Uh, yeah, we need flowers. Pretty, pretty flowers. And other stuff. I don't know if saplings work exactly, but I would rather just go with flowers because I know they work 100% of the time. 
I'm so happy we're actually we are actually getting a diamond pickaxe and we're going home. Oh, it just sounds so good. Oh yeah, so my map um you know was destroyed. I don't know if I already said that, but we're gonna have to make a new one. But you know, um the reeds most likely are overgrown. The pigs and chickens have probably escaped and are probably running my snow fort. Sir Francis is most likely just sitting on all the chests while Wilson's like, I don't know, sharpening his sword and hunting wild boar. Why not? That's that's how I imagine the, you know, what's going on right now back at the house. What in the hell? Oh, just more sheep. Goodbye, rams. Ooh, what is that? Oh, I'm getting so distracted, but I want to see what it is. Right before we go, what is this? Okay, is that, is that like a broken structure? Kind of looks like that's a broken structure right there. Or someone tried to build a tree house and it didn't really work out or something. All right, nevertheless, no matter what it is, I don't care. Uh, I think that's enough flowers, right? Do we have enough flowers? Oops. Ooh, I hear zombies and mosquitoes. I like how I'm actually more afraid of the mosquitoes than the stupid zombies. Because what a zombie? Oh my god, there they are. Get away. Do they actually poison you? I think they do. Oh, dead. Oh, yeah, they give you hunger. What? <laughs> Have you ever gotten... Got, oh, well, I guess if you get bit by a mosquito, you start losing blood, and then you're hungry. Sure. All right. <laughs> oh, my God. We're done. Throw... Oh, yeah, I forgot I had seven. Throwing a diamond in. Oh. And we're back. Or, well, we're not back. We're home. We're done. It's finished. <sighs> well... Twilight Forest, um, you have been a hell of a mod and a hell of a realm. I'd like to go back here once I'm more, you know, prepared. <laughs> and um, maybe I'll have, like, one of those charms. I'm just trying to think of a way, like, that I can come here without being totally screwed if I die. I guess you have to be really smart when you get in this realm. All right. But anyway, I'm coming home. Hopefully I actually spawn at my fort. Please. <laughs> okay, and I'm in nothingness. Oh. Oh. Where? Okay. Aw, oh, crap. Uh-oh. This isn't good. We are in the middle of nowhere and sand's falling. I'm gonna actually use that to my advantage. Let's get the hell out of here. Where are we? Oh, this isn't good at all. <laughs> this is not good at all. Don't tell me... Oh my god, we are really actually r wicked far down. What the? What is that? Oh, okay. Um. So we spawn. What is that? We spawn in the middle of nowhere. What the? Is that just like water? <laughs> okay, whoa. It's like a little air pocket. That's <laughs> actually. Or not. Is it an air pocket? Oh my god, it's an air pocket. That is so cool. But you know what's not cool, guys? Uh, <laughs> I have literally no idea where I am. Oh my god. Holy crap. Oh, that's not good. Holy crap. I have no clue. Where anything is oh no this is actually really bad oh oh my god this is terrible <laughs> Jesus what the heck I did not oh my god this is uh, oh wow <laughs> I'm swimming to, like, this little piece of land over there. Oh, my God. We're actually stranded. Oh, no. Oh, my God. Look at that. This is what we get. <laughs> oh, what the hell? Look at this. Where am I? Oh, my God. Oh. Well, we made it out of the Twilight Forest. I probably couldn't even find it again. The portal. Alright, so... What I think I can do... Is look into the records... Of my past experiences. 
see <laughs> I guess see where my fort is in a in a radial direction that has to do with the moon and the sun, you know, like see which direction it is, the cardinal direction, and just travel in that direction? Would that work? No, it wouldn't, would it? I have to have some kind of bearing, don't I? Because, like, all right, I'm going I'm to draw it out for you guys. <clears throat> if my snow fort's here, okay, and I see in... I see in, like, one of my last, my, my leader, my last videos that, like, that uh, here's, like, the, where the sun rises, and that's where it sets, okay? So it sets in the west, oops, sorry, so it sets in the west, right, like, right there. That would mean that if I see the sun rise here, and I travel that way, I should come across my snow fort, unless... I'm already past my snow fort. So let's say I'm already here and I travel west. I'm just going to go even more past it. So pretty much if I can't see, oops, well, that's not the right setting. If I can't see anything on far. Oh, this isn't good. I cannot believe how literally stranded I am. This is, okay, you know what this is? This is like one of those custom maps that people make. It's like, oh, Skyblock, hee <laughs> this will be fun. Except this is actually real. This is like in an actual Minecraft world. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. <laughs> well, it's just me and Larry. <laughs> Larry's so stupid. I want Wilson back. Wilson! Oh, this is like the perfect time to do that. Yeah, you can just sing me a, a tune, Larry, can't you? Oh, no. Yeah, thanks, Larry. Oh, God. So, oh my, I don't know what... I can't believe I just got lost again. Alright, shut up, shut up. Why would I think that was a good idea? Oh, I'm trying to just think what, what to do. What would you, what would you guys do? I have, <laughs> I have no compass. I have no map. The only thing I could possibly... I'm going to starve. I'm going to starve. That just that just hit me. I have two golden apples. Um, Actually, I have a lot of mushrooms. That's what's going to keep me alive is my mushrooms. I can make a ton of mushroom soup because the bowls are renewable. So I'm not going to starve. <laughs> uh, I might die of boredom. Or, you know, sharks or creatures from the Black Lagoon might come up and attack me. I mean, I could just make a boat and just travel in a direction. Wow. I mean, I, I literally am just dumbfounded. I have no idea what to do from here. Like, <laughs> oh my god. I'm, uh, I could pray to the, I could just pray to the ender gods <clears throat> that I recently slayed and just you know, hope that they somehow get me back or give some sort of direction of where I'm supposed to go. Why don't I do that? Why don't I... I didn't even bring a bed. That's just great. Oh, why don't I send my prayers to the Ender Dragon in hope that he finds me fit still to slay and kill whatever the hell he wants me to kill. So maybe I'm too val in, you know, too valuable for him to lose and he'll... Okay, help, help me off this, this stupid plus sign. I cannot believe this. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, and yeah, so next episode, I'm not really sure, but uh, I'll, I'll hopefully get off of this island and everything will be dandy. But until then, I will see you guys all later.